Hi, I'm Tom Stewart with Cleaning Business Today. In our last KPI tip, we built a spreadsheet which we track turnover rates. In this tip, we're going to show you how to take the data out of that spreadsheet and turn it into a graph. A graph oftentimes makes it easier to see which way your numbers are moving and to find trends. Excel is pretty smart at doing this. The first thing you would do is just highlight your dates, and I'm going to use my mouse and drag down starting at uh, December 2013 all the way uh, through our most recent month. I'm going to hold down the control key and now highlight my annual turnover rates. I'm going to go up to insert and I'm going to click on line graph and just click on line and bam I've got a graph. Uh, where it says series 1 we'd probably be better off to actually put the title of what that is and to do that we're going to do a right hand click and say select data and where I've got series 1 I'm going to say edit and for the name, I'm going to say annual turnover rate total 12 month and say OK. And that will show up there and, and also here. But since I only have one line on this graph, I don't need that. So I'm going to delete that. And I have a graph that you can print, share with your staff, and use this to track on a month to month basis which way your turnover rate is trending. And you can see as a rule it's going down, which, which is a good thing. In this particular technique of developing graphs, you can apply this to most of the KPI tips that, that we share. I hope that you find this KPI tip helpful. Thank you for watching Cleaning Business Today.